wants to be a game streamer or a live streamer, but what does it really take? Today we talked to at Chloe underscore ZA about what it takes to be a streamer. Hello, thank you so much for having me. It's great to be here. Awesome, Chloe. So tell me a bit about what you do. So I'm a live content creator and a gamer. Um, I spend many hours gaming during the week. I also do a bit of editing and content creation for my social media platforms. Um, yes, yeah, so that's what I do. That sounds awesome. Like, I know a lot of kids these days want to stream and they want to play games for a living. But how, what do you do? Like, what? platforms do we use to stream? So we have three big platforms that are being looked at at the moment. We have Twitch, which is the biggest. 72% of viewers were watching Twitch in quarter one of 2021. Wow. Um, Facebook in third place, actually, YouTube in second place with 15% in quarter one of viewers watching uh, YouTube. And then Facebook in last place with 12% of viewers in quarter one. So the biggest platform at the moment is definitely Twitch. Um, it's definitely advisable to start on Twitch, but there are pros and cons to, uh, you know, all of the platforms. Of course, and what do you prefer? So I prefer Twitch because I feel like Twitch has definitely been designed as a gaming platform. The focus of Twitch is live game streaming, although there are tons of other categories on Twitch. Um, it was designed for live game streaming, whereas Facebook and YouTube, although they have great platforms for, for gaming, it was kind of a secondary thing. You know, Facebook is a social media platform first. YouTube is a pre-recorded content platform. So even though they are great growing, um, Twitch is definitely still dominant at the moment. That sounds awesome. I'm also wondering what you need to start streaming in terms of hardware. Right, so that's a very good question, something that is asked a lot. There is a wealth of information on the internet that will tell you exactly what you need. Definitely have a look at companies like Acer, see what you can buy from them. You could start with a laptop or you could start with a PC. Even if you wanted to console stream, you could do that with just a laptop and your console. I would advise that you do as much research as possible. Definitely Google what the minimum specs are that are needed to start streaming. Um, but you can start with something, you know, something quite basic and small and, um, you know, move on to something bigger. Obviously, you'll also need your microphone and your webcam if you do want to show your face on your streams. Um, yeah, so a couple of peripherals. Awesome. Thank you so much, Chloe. You're so welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button below and please subscribe to our channel so that you can get this stuff while it's fresh. See you soon.